my god guys <laughs> today is the most monday day ever <laughs> that makes any sort of sense i knew it was going to be pretty busy this week because we're only working a four-day work week we have good friday off so we'll be having this friday off um so <laughs> i took the weekend off from everything like from messaging from anything and everything gave my self time just to be to live in the moment to do my thing to you know be with the people that I love and just do my thing just do my thing and I absolutely fucking loved it it was so fucking nice you guys it is I don't know if a lot of you here on um on uh I can't think on YouTube no I work a full-time job. I don't just make YouTube videos or like OnlyFans content or Instagram content. I work a Monday through Friday, nine hour job a day. And I do this on the side for fun. Man, I'm enjoying my new position because it's exactly, it's constantly dealing with all sorts of things, which is exactly what I'm dealing with today. We had two windows installed in our lobby. We had our coffee machine break down, so I had to take care of that. We had three new hires start today, which I am a part of that as well, of our HR team and a part of the facilities. <laughs> they started today. Well, we just recently moved. If you guys have been following me on Instagram, knowing this journey that I've been going on with my promotion, we, we moved our desks. Our, I'm a part of the HR team now and my desk that I met now I love it I don't want to leave this desk because it's very it's pretty much just me it's pretty much just me and my boss because I was an executive assistant well we're still looking for somebody to replace me so I'm still doing my current job I'm still I'm doing my current job and I'm doing my job I'm still doing things for my boss so I have two bosses technically <laughs> not really I have one boss but I'm still helping him out um I don't want to leave him hanging. I, I don't want anything to go through the cracks. So I'm doing two jobs at the same time. And it's not very easy. And it is what it is kind of at this point. But so we we're moving our department. I'm moving with HR department. We moved our desk not last Friday, but the Friday before two weeks ago. And it was an all day event, all day event on that Friday. Thursday, we kind of prepped for it. And then that Friday was just a full day. Well, fast forward today, we have new office pieces being delivered. Well, they didn't never tell us when these office pieces were gonna be delivered because they said that they would notify us because we've gotta move other pieces of furniture out of the way to make room for these new desks that are coming in for these other girls in a different department. They never told us, it kinda of just showed up today. And all of this happened before noon. From eight to noon, all of this shit has gone down. And it's been busy just with regular guests, things that pop up. So we had a VP. Okay, so this is one of the things that popped up. One of our B VPs of our marketing, um, our marketing VP, she was getting on our elevator and she had her iPad and her mouse and she had her stylus. Her stylus rolls off of her iPad and right down that little crack in between the elevator and the floor. It went all the way down. <laughs> I've got to call our ele elevator company to add. I mean, she has a replacement one, but she personally bought this one. She spent money on it, and those things are not cheap. So <laughs> I've got to schedule the next time our elevator company is out to inspect, to do their usual routine, to open the elevator shaft at the bottom and take her pin out. <laughs> we had so many people stop by our office today. If they're looking to clean our building, if they're looking to do any sort of repairs at our office, I handle those. So I had back-to-back -back people, contractors coming in, asking if we needed this, if we needed that, do we need a new cleaning crew, do we need anything around the office? And I'm just like, no, we're good right now. So it's been a crazy fucking Monday. I knew, I knew this week would be crazy. I didn't know this Monday was going to be this crazy. And also we have a blood drive going on. We have a blood drive, this huge bus, mobile bus that's in front of our business. Um, so the employees can give blood. Technically we're in like a business park area of any that makes sense. So all the other businesses are coming to us. I organized that. I set it up. I had to make sure they had places to park. Well, we have this huge bus that's sitting in front of one. We have two entrances, one entrance, one entrance that nobody really, 
the blood drive okay sorry i accidentally hit my phone off um we have two entrances one's the main we have a back one for employees but that doesn't count and then we have another entrance over to the side which nobody uses so we had a ton of available parking where they could pop park their bus well the furniture that is being delivered that showed up two hours later after the the our blood drive is starting needs to get into that door that that bus parked in so it can bring the furniture in through that door because you cannot bring the furniture through the main door the main lobby because our windows were being installed <laughs> so we had to really figure out what the hell we were going to do and how we were going to do it. But we got it all figured out. We got it all situated. I was able to go to lunch, which you know that means that's a good day. I'm hoping by the time I get back, things are kind of calmed down and settled. But I just wanted to pop on here and let you guys know that um, I'm, I'm going to try to answer. I love answering my DMs. And I love talking to you guys in my messages. That's how I feel that I get to know you guys, that I get to know my audience. And it's crazy to think the next month is gonna be a whole year on YouTube. I My goal in my first year was to at least to hit 10,000. It looks like I might, I might do that. By no means am I trying to get the most subscribers. That is not my goal. At the end of the day with my channel, my goal is to get music out that nobody's ever heard of. Like my soundtrack series, the last, um, video that I did was a soundtrack series. I used to do that. I'm coming back around to that. I want to get good music out to people who may have not heard some of this music and, and in turn you guys suggest stuff to me that I've never heard of. Again, if I didn't do this channel, I wouldn't know who Nightwish is. I wouldn't know who Epica is, which I've got a video of those two. If I can get to editing it, <laughs> I, I will be uploading that video next, uh, Nightwish and Epica. But my goal with this channel is not to get them not to get the most subscribers not to get the most none of that it, that that's not my my goal here you guys it is a milestone for me to hit 10,000 organically with my channel with all of you who who are here following me i don't want to do the exact same videos and i don't want to do that i want to bring a huge variety to my channel the majority of what i really want to do with my channel is to get out good music keep good music alive a lot of people don't cover seven dust i love seven dust i will bring be bringing tons of that to my channel whether four or five people watch that video great i don't care i i think the last video i did it's only it has less than 300 views on it i don't care those people that are viewing it in fact i i if i can pull up the comment and i can find it there was a comment on my seven dust video corrected which is from scorpion king part of the um god it's fucking hot uh, part of the uh, soundtrack series that i want to do a lot more here on my channel said that they've been listening to seven dust for 20 or 21 years and had no idea that that song existed had no idea that song existed and that's what i i take joy in doing here on youtube and you guys anything else that comes along with that is just an added bonus Again, like I said, I don't want to get, oh, I have to do this video in order to get this many followers. I want people to find me naturally. I want people to find me organically and enjoy my content. I want to bring that niche of what I'm covering here to this channel. And again, in turn, you guys tell me about bands that I've never heard of that I can cover. Um, if you guys are watching this and you are, all, you are subscribed to my OnlyFans, I will be getting to y'all's videos as soon as I can. I still have some videos off of my Instagram posts that I put, on, put out in January that I need to do. I have not forgot about you guys, about your requests. I have not, they're sitting there. I need to edit these videos. <laughs> a lot of these videos are weeks old, maybe even a few months old because with my job, I cannot edit as much as I, would be able to edit like a year ago. Um, it's just that I, I'm more chaotic now, all over the place at my job, all over my building, um, having to go leave the property to go deal with other things. Um, so yeah, I've got a lot of videos I need to edit. I need to get cut, cut, get caught back up on. Um, a lot of those that have requested it on my post on Instagram, I know you guys are there. Even some of my DMs I might have to go back and find. I do want to do these videos. 
I just ask that you be patient with me. And I'm not sitting here. Nobody's complained about anything. Let me get that right. Nobody has been like, where's this video? Nobody has said that to me. But I just want to let you guys know that I am working to uh, get those edited, to get those uploaded. Um, and I have not forgotten about you guys. How can I forget about you guys? You guys are my fucking followers. And I appreciate every single one of you that show up day in, day out on my YouTube, on my Instagram, on my OnlyFans, who are just there constantly giving me positive feedback. I cannot say thank you enough. I sincerely cannot say thank you enough. If I could do this as a full-time job, you guys, I'd be live every fucking day on all three of my platforms. Every day, that's a guarantee. But, you know, in the meantime, I'm not going to say this. I will say in the next two years, though, I would like to do a full-time working from home job, probably with a different company, just because... I don't know if I will be staying in the state that I'm in. I kind of want to move and I don't want my job to tie me down. And I want to move like away. <laughs> but that's that's all in the future and at least a two year plan that I am working on. But you guys, I just wanted to say thank you. Let you guys kind of know what's going on on uh, YouTube, on my Instagram, on my OnlyFans. Um, I've been a very, 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 very busy girl with work. This work is this this week's gonna be busy. Today's gonna be busy. I hope by the time I get back from lunch, I'm able to get caught up on emails, do my desk work that I need to do that I need to get caught up on. Um, and yeah, and tonight I'm gonna try to edit a video. I'm gonna try to to message a lot of you back today, especially if this afternoon is very, very quiet, and I'm able to just do my desk work. More likely, you will hear from me. So yeah. I just want to say thank you guys again. We are almost hitting 10,000 on this channel and I cannot say thank you enough. Also, when we hit 10,000, I will be doing another Q and A. It's a full year with a whole bunch of new people here. Um, let me know if that'd be something you are, you would be interested in seeing a new Q and A. Also, I've got, I don't know if any of you guys know what Funkos are. I would assume a lot of you out there who follow me know exactly what Funko Pops are, the little figurines. Well, I like to collect those. I like to collect a lot. If you're if you watch my videos that I have the new wide angle lens on, you can see where my mouse is at on where my hand is usually resting. That cabinet that that is there below the below the uh, gruesome twosome poster and Ozfest poster, those that first line are Funko Pops, the original like My Little Ponies because I was obsessed with that. And then I have like Elvira, Mariah Carey, I think Little Mermaid. I love, again, you guys, if you don't know me, I love Little Mermaid as well. And Little Mermaid. But in my closet that is behind me, if you watch my videos, I have that big black tapestry. And then there's a door right next to it. There's two doors. One is the door that goes to the rest of my apartment. And the other door is a closet. That closet, there's a shelf in there that is full of Funko Pops. I think I might have to break it up in a two video type thing. But let me know if that's something you guys would be interested in seeing. I have a two-part video of all the Funko Pops that I have and just share that collection with you. And also if you would be interested in a new Q&A. And if we, if I do a QA, and a it will be on my community tab and it will be on Instagram. It will be two posts, maybe even OnlyFans, just so I can go back to these posts as I'm filming it and I can read off your questions and I can read off who submitted those questions. Um, so yeah, and if your username doesn't have your name in it, or if you'd rather, if you'd want me to shout out your name for that question, just leave it in that comment. Like, hi, my name is so-and-so, this is my question for you, so I can properly address you guys. <laughs> but you guys, it's been a crazy fucking Monday, and I know I'm not the only one. We can do it. Positive vibes. Thank you guys. From the bottom of my heart, I cannot say thank you enough. So you guys, that is going to wrap up this video. I just wanted to pop on here and let you guys know... It's been a crazy ass fucking Monday, that's for sure. I hope your day is going smoothly. If you're on the other side of the world, it is nighttime for you and I hope you get some Z's and I hope you have a wonderful, wonderful night. Just wanted to check in on you guys. Let me know about the Q&A. Let me know if you want the video on a Funko Pop. And yeah, I'll do them, that's for sure. You guys, thank you for being so patient with me, being so understanding that I work a full-time job and that I try to get to your suggestions as fast as I can. So I just want to say thank you. From the bottom of my heart, you guys are, be you guys are the best. Bye-bye. You guys are the best. Bye.